What's up guys, it's Zane here and welcome to my guide to 99 construction. Now I might not be talking about everything in construction, but we're going to be talking about how to get 99 construction. Now remember this is a money sink, so it's going to cost a lot of GP. Yep, that's pretty much it. This is going to be really fast, so try to keep up. So the requirements for this guide is you need at least 2.3 billion GP. You need 70 crafting, you actually need it, it is a requirement to get gold leaves, 40 mining, and 50 wood cutting. If you don't have these skills, you can really easily get them. You could probably get 70 crafting, 40 mining, and 50 wood cutting in less than half an hour. So it's pretty easy to get ready for 99 uh, construction. The only bad thing is the 2.3 bill, but uh, it is a money sink skill, so that's pretty obvious. The tools needed is a saw, hammer, hatchet, and pickaxe. Now, the only tools you actually need for construction are the saw and hammer, but the hatchet and pickaxe allows you to get the supplies that you need. So, how do you do construction? How do you start it? You have to talk to the estate agent and buy the 12 room package. I suggest not getting the donator only or the premium only. I suppose if you are a donator or premium, you could get the 25 room package, but you don't need the 150 room room package and the three room package is too small. I personally use the 12 room package. Then you want to enter your house via the portal, the purple portal <laughs> and click building mode. You want to make a parlor which costs around 10 mil and confirm building it. You can move it around and turn it clockwise and anti-clockwise and see where you want the doors. You could pretty much shape your house around how I'm shaping my house right now. Uh, it just depends on how you want to do it. It takes a little bit of time to load and that's about it. Then you want to make a garden because this actually allows you to have three extra hot spots uh, or yeah hot spots are the doors, the little white things, and you want to do a garden because it allows you to have three rooms right there. It costs around 40 mil to make a garden. Now next is a question that I actually get asked a lot, uh, making nails. You can't actually buy nails unless you buy them from other players. You have to make them. Now to make a nail, generally what players want is the steel nail. It, co it costs to mine it is uh, one iron and two coal, and then you want to smith it via skilling and just make those steel bars. Now I make iron bars at first because I was testing out something else, but uh, you want to make steel bars. You don't need iron bars at all. Then you want to grab yourself a hammer and you want to smith them. You want to make steel nails. Now you really don't need that many steel nails. You only need like 60 or something like that to actually uh, do it because you're only going to be using them for uh, chairs. Then you want to get some planks. I'll teach you how to make planks later. And you want to make the chair space. You want to pretty much make chairs until level 10. You unlock a new chair at level 8, and then you want to make those, obviously. And then around level 10, you'll actually be able to make yourself a dining room. A dining room costs like 40 mil or something. And what you're actually going to be building on the dining room is the little, uh, what are they called, the seating space right there. And you want to make the wooden bench. And pretty much you're going to stay here until level 61. Now, you're going to want a butler, and this means that you need to make a bedroom. Now to make a bedroom, it I believe it cost, it's level 20, and to make the um, the little bed it is also level 20. You also need bolts of cloth, which can be bought in the shops. So you want to build the bed space, and you need two bedrooms, one for yourself and one for your butler. This is just kind of a requirement, um, but definitely get this because the butler helps you a ton and makes it so much faster. So to get to a butler, simply talk to an estate agent and buy yourself a butler. Then the butler will follow you around. You're going to be able to tell him to stop following you, ask how many rooms are in you, and uh, also get your bank in which you can deposit and take things out, which is really awesome. So how the trees, you're going to be going to the woodcutting area a lot. And first off, you're going to want oak. Um, some oak logs to make into oak planks. And how you do this is you go to Sears Village. You're going to need a little bit of cash with you to actually do this. So I go into the bank and I grab some cash. And you're going to want to make planks. Now later on this video, we're actually going to teach you how to make planks in your house. But right now, just use the sawmill. Uh, it is a little more expensive. I believe it's around 75k, but uh, it's still worth it. And you want to just keep on doing this until you have the set amount of oak planks that you need. Then you simply want to start making oak benches, which is around level 22 uh, construction, and you want to remove them. Now, if you see this, you can actually change it so it says, yes, uh, don't ask me to remove it ever again, and it makes it a lot faster. Then you want to build um, the good old work bench area place, and this is where you're going to be able to make um, repair armors and repair plank or make planks and things like that. And it's really cheap. It's around 55 kgp per plank and it just makes it a lot faster since your butler's right there 
you just want to keep on making these planks and this is how you can actually make uh, any kind of plank of course but if when you're first starting out construction and you're making normal planks you definitely would just want to go to the sawmill but this is really good to make planks now you might not want to do oaks all the way to the mahogany bench so you might want to be able to do teaks and so you just go to the wood cutting area cut down some teaks and make the teak uh, the planks out of them it's really easy and then you can get to what is it like level 52 for the mahogany benches and then you can just make mahogany benches as you can see I got my mahogany benches and then you run over here and you make uh, the teak benches until level 52 so mahoganies are in the wood cutting area you just chop them down and they give you a little bit of wood cutting XP and then you obviously want to make uh, the mahogany planks out of them then you go over to your little area you want to take out some mahogany planks and you want to make the seating space you just want to make mahogany benches until level 61 or 60 actually and then you want to make a throne room and this is where you're going to be spending most of your time and you want to start building the benches at 52 um, these are going to cost I believe what is it 12 per area so this is a little bit more expensive than the dining room but it definitely gives better XP and you want to do this until level 61 once you get 61 you can make gilded benches so to do this you want to get gold or far stuff you can either do this in the mining area or the crafting guild which you'll see later but you know just get your uh, get your gold ore and just mine it up now there is a um, area you can go through that door that guy just went through it and there's a bank there but if you have the 70 crafting which you're going to need anyways go to the crafting guild you can you know get rid of that gold ore and then you can actually see there's uh, gold ores the gold veins right there and you can just mine them and there's a bank right there so that's really really good now once you have the gold ore you want to run over here and make them into gold bars so this is a lot faster than going to the smithing area and whatnot, and you're going to need it anyway, so I suggest getting 90 or 70 crafting before you do anything. Then you want to talk to this guy and make the gold bars into gold leaves for 150k each. And this is kind of what makes construction expensive, is making gold leaves. So you just want to do this with all your gold leaves. Obviously, you're going to need a lot more gold leaves than this. This is just showing you the basics. And then you want to build the seating spot and you want to make gilded mahogany benches which is 18k per bench which is really really good and yeah that's about it guys that's how you get 99 construction you're actually going to be keep on doing this until you are 99 construction i'm sorry if i talked a little fast i just wanted to get it down you can always go back through the guide and figure out what you need to do but you know keep on making gilded benches until level 99 so some stats for you guys, it's 12.7 million XP doing gilded benches, that's 707 benches at 18k XP each. Making leaves, which is 150k each, is 1.2 bill. Uh, making the mahogany planks costs around 466 mil at 55k each average. Um, it costs around 550 mil to get to level 61 itself. That means buying the rooms, buying the butler, all that kind of good stuff. So 99 construction costs around 2.3 bill. This is a money sink, obviously, um, but yeah. And you're going to be looking at around making 8.5k mahogany planks and gold leaves. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, tap the like button. Peace out.